what means for a musician as you and for your band to arrive in a festival and to play every day with a, a crew that you don't know, with a stage that you don't know. Just explain very reality your opinion, your feeling about the sound on stage and sound out the stage. Well, we played in two venues really. We played one night in the Quattro Novembre and six nights in Carducci, uh, Jardin Carducci. Um, in general, the big fear for all performing musicians when you come to a, a festival or new concert hall, uh, you worry about, uh, you worry less about your music and more about uh, the, the sound, not only the sound for the audience, but the sound and the monitors. I always say there are three sounds. There's what the audience hears, what we hear in the monitors, and what we actually sound like. And it's very important uh, for the band and for each musician that what he thinks and knows he sounds like is what's going out there. And we worry that if someone is giving me, for example, me, I don't like a lot of reverb, I like just a little bit. And I want to be able to say this to the sound and people and make sure they do this every night. It's different uh, for me. Uh, uh, there's always the unknown because you're dealing with a sound team that you haven't had. Although in this case, I've been dealing with reference uh, so long, I know most of the sound people and I... And, uh, my oldest friend here in Italy, one of them is Angelo Torini, who's from reference. So here I come with some confidence. Generally, it's a problem. And outdoors is much worse than, than a theater. Because the, in a good theater, in Morlocky, for instance, the theater helps a lot. And sound is in one place. On a windy night outdoors, the wind is blowing, the, everything is different. The wind across the microphones, the wind, uh, for instance, the other night it was a big wind, the trumpet players are playing, the wind is blowing right back in the bells. All of this disturbs you as a, as a musician and it affects sound. So it's important to have professionals who understand the role of the musician, understand why the saxophone is a different instrument to, re to, uh, amp to reinforce sound-wise than the keyboards or the guitar. On the stage, we, I'm an acoustic player, and now I'm hearing my, um, in the monitors, different. The guitar is always electric, it's, so it's a big problem, particularly for wind, wind instrument players. But it's all about professional people and good equipment on the stage. The microphones must be of quality, the cables very important, the, and the engineer must know what he's doing. Somebody must be on stage if something goes wrong to immediately fix it. But outdoors is a bigger challenge. Things like feedback can happen and it's really nobody's fault. So these things have to all be dealt with.